Good morning, Atlanta Coast High School. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. Please be seated. It's Friday, December 8th, and welcome to the Morning Rays. Congratulations to all of the new members of the National Honor Society. The induction ceremony took place last night, and many deserving students were welcomed in to NHS. Next up is the Spanish Honor Society induction ceremony on Monday night at 6 o'clock. Don't forget, there are rehearsals right after school on Monday. See Mr. Z with any questions. The National Art Honor Society will be meeting on Monday, December 11th in room 107. Please bring an outdoor ornament to decorate our garden, and this will be the last day to pay dues. Monday is the day we host Mandarin and boys basketball. The game was originally supposed to be tonight, but it will now be on Monday the 11th in the tank at 6 o'clock for JV and 7.30 for varsity. Be on the lookout for a dress-up theme to be announced soon by the Stingray section on Instagram. Congratulations to our girls' basketball team. They picked up another win last night. This time it was Reigns catching an L. 41-24 was the final as the Lady Stingrays win. Just a reminder, there is an interest meeting for our boys and girls tennis teams next Monday, December 11th, in room 517 after school. Again, this meeting is for both boys and girls interested in playing for the AC tennis team. Monday also marks the start of Winter Wonder Week. There are dress-up themes for each school day next week. What's up, guys? I'm Ezra. I'm Bradley. And we are your upperclassmen society presidents. And these are the themes for Winter Wonder Week. Go Rays. Monday, December 11th, is going to be Santa versus his helpers. Make sure you all show up in red and green, Santa hats, and elf ears. Tuesday, December 12th, is going to be Flannel versus Frost. Make sure you all show up in any flannel you all have. Wednesday, December 13th, is going to be Winter Wonder Week Whiteout. On Wednesday, December 13th, is an early release day and also the Junior versus Senior Kickball game. So don't forget to show up and show out. Thursday, December 14th, is Baby It's Cold Outside. Make sure to wear your ugly sweaters and your tacky socks. Friday, December 15th, twas a week before Christmas break. Make sure y'all show up in your holiday PJs. Friday is our PSR senior breakfast. Only post-secondary ready seniors are allowed to go. And finally, we have a message to deliver from Coco Peppermittens. He would like to say thank you to all of his new fans. He's still getting used to being a star and everything that goes along with that. Coco and Dan Lowe are back again one last time this morning, but Coco has informed the Morning Rays that he is retiring from being a celebrity elf so that he can focus solely on his academics. We will introduce a new elf on next week's December with Dan Levitch segments, but in the meantime, please enjoy a few jokes and trivia questions as we say goodbye. Whatever y'all do, say no, y'all don't want to joke. Don't, don't. Come on, Pepper. Come on, Pepper. What do you call an elf that can sing? Walter. <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> what do you call an elf that can sing? A singing elf? No. Jingle bells? No. Oh, that's a good one. Carol Snow. No. What is it? A rapper. <laughs> like a rapper. A real rapper. Yeah, a rapper. <laughs> Dean Tiller, can you can you please tell us what you think of Mr. Coco Peppermittens here? <laughs> what? You definitely caught me off guard with that. This is Coco Peppermint and straight from the North Pole. He's here to help spread holiday cheer. <laughs> I can't. I'm, so, I'm sorry. In Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol, what was the first name of Scrooge? The first name of Mr. Scrooge? Mm -hmm. um, I'm drawing a blank. I should know this. <sighs> Scrooge? <laughs> Ms. McIntosh? Ebenezer Scrooge! Ebenezer! What did Frosty the Snowman do when a magic hat was placed on his head? Came to life. Any answers? Oh. 
was gonna say. He did kind of come to life, but he did something very specific once he came to life. Any final answers? How about you, Mr. Peppermittens? You got anything? What did Frosty do when the magic hat was put on his head? What did Frosty do when it melted? No, you guys, he began to dance around. Which one of Santa's reindeer has the same name as another holiday mascot? Blitzen? <laughs> she said Blitzen. February. March? <laughs> what? <laughs> you can ask the question again. Cupid. Cupid. In the movie Elf. What is the first rule of the Code of the Elves? Oh, I don't remember. I don't remember. I'm so disappointed in I this campus. This weekend too, and I don't remember. Treat every day like Christmas. It's Coco Peppermint. I'm checking out. And Miss Danlevich. We'll be back soon with some more holiday cheer.